watching my series of Ghostbusters reboot uh, videos, what I want to talk about now is family friendliness of this. This new re uh, Ghostbusters reboot movie is absolutely f much more family friendly compared to the original. Now I'm not going to get into detail, but if you're watching this video, you've probably seen the original Ghostbusters. and. I guess I, it's safe to say that uh, sexuality is part of the plot. There's some very, very sexual situations in the original Ghostbusters. I'm not going to name them, but I clearly remember them. It's actually part of the plot at the end with Rick Moranis. Uh, there's that going on. And then there's this scene with Dan, Dan Aykroyd and something that happens with him and a ghost. You don't have anything like that in the new Ghostbusters movie. So for that, reason the new Ghostbusters movie is much more family friendly. There's less profanity. There's really, there's a few innuendos, but it's nothing compared to the original one. The first one had all out sexual situations. The new one doesn't. So for that, this new one, and what's funny is the original was rated PG. This one's PG 13. Really, there's really hardly anything sexual in it. The first one drenched in sexual situations. So I will have to give the movie credit for that. As I mentioned in the last video, this one is more Hollywood cookie cutter. And these days, what's happening is Hollywood makes PG-13 rated movies that are really based for kids, but they have just enough to make them PG-13 so that, so that uh, teenagers, teenagers will watch them instead of just kids. So I will say that something that an advantage that the new reboot has is it's more family friendly. Because even in the second one, which wasn't a sexual Ghostbusters 2, you still saw, saw what Sigourney Weaver in her bra for no reason with her baby. So this one, there's no nudity or outright sexual situations going on. So there is that positive thing we can say for parents wondering about taking their kids to see it. It's, it's much more tame than the first one ever was. I don't know that I could sit down and watch the first one with my son because of those situations. I wouldn't feel comfortable. But the new one, I had no reservations. This is Nick Shell, the internet receding hairline guy, doing a special series about Ghostbusters Reboot.